What's going on, Doc and Fam, and welcome back to the channel. We're back here with another 100% Rainbow Showcase, and this time it's going to be Outburst of Emotions, Super Saiyan 2, Vegeta, and Bulma. Now, guys, this is one of my absolute favorite units in the game. He hits so damn hard. Like, he has tanked events for me so many times I've lost count because he not only has a powerful attack, but he has an extremely powerful counter, and if your health gets to 30% or below, he goes into rage mode where he does three attacks and takes zero damage. So there's lots of good things to behold when you finally get this man rainbowed. And um, yes, there is an AGL version of this unit, and I already did make a showcase for that card, and that card is free to play. So if you're thinking about getting that unit and grinding it out and putting the orbs in, I'll link to that video at the end of this one and in the info section below so you can take a look because that card does some devastating damage too. But out of the two, this is the one you really want because he's just insane. So I'm gonna at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you guys what I did in terms of hidden potential. Uh, but I would like to let you know from the start that I did max out his crit. Typically when I do any card or any unit that I play with, I always max the crit out. It's just how I play the game. Um, but I will show you everything that I did do in the hidden potential area after we do a nuke test and then we just do a standard run. I can show you guys how he plays on a regular team without the nuke. I'm actually really excited because I have yet to even do a nuke test with him. And the nuke lead that you're gonna have to have in order to do this is um, Inkling of Ultimate Power, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, GT, Golden Giant Ape, and for every key sphere obtained, you get attack plus 33%. Um, the only thing that kind of stinks about this, guys, is he can turn into a giant golden ape, so we're just gonna hope that doesn't happen so it doesn't take away from the nuke test that we're trying to do. Also, guys, I am doing the Sublime Blue event and I'm doing it for a couple different reasons. Number one, we will have a chance to attack um, Fizz Vegito Blue, so we'll do a nuke test on him, and then if we can make it to the last stage, I'm pretty sure we can, uh, but if we can make it to the last stage, I would love to nuke test on Tech Vegito. Guys, when I play this with my normal team, with Super Saiyan 4 Goku as my lead, like, he's taken out three quarters of uh, of the final version of Tech Vegito all on his own because he piles up his attack. Sometimes he'll attack like four times at once and dude like Vegeta's counter is just so intense and he crits nine times out of ten too. I don't know if it's just me but like seriously he is always criticaling on his counter attack and you guys are gonna see that so that's why I'm doing this event so let's just get started let's just jump right in and what's funny about this event too is it's kind of random where the key shows up because I've gone left and I've gone right and gotten pretty much the same amount of key boosts but we're gonna try and go for a key boost here okay well we can go to the right and at least get that key boost so we're just gonna do that so we're gonna go right got one let's see if this one is one as well damn it was a capsule that's okay got one more key boost down here and if we can get that last one, that would be sweet. And if we get a one, we got it. Nice. It's going to be a good day. <laughs> here we go. So the goal here, guys, is we're going to do a nuke test on Fizz Vegito and then save the last nuke, hopefully, for the final stage of Tech Vegito. Um, if we don't make it that far, then we'll use it on the second to last stage because it's still Tech Vegito. But I really want to nuke Vegito in his final form. So I, I just want to like obliterate him. Here we go. You know, I actually just might. This might actually work out pretty well as long as he doesn't super me off the bat. Okay, good. Here we go. Take him out. Bam! You're dead. There's no way he's gonna survive. Now, oh, he survived. What? Oh, two attacks in a row. Sweet. You guys are getting a little bit of a, of a rainbow uh, Vegito showcase at the same time, I guess. Obviously, he can do much more damage than that. What is the, the highest now we've seen online? Somebody did like 40 million damage with, <laughs> with LR Vegito. Holy crap. All right, guys, so here we go. So this is going to be the first nuke test. Um, we're just going to flip these around. Let's see if this is better. Yeah, it's probably going to be better that way. 
All right, so, or is this better? Hold on. Yeah, we're gonna do it that way. All right, so what we're gonna do is we are gonna do the nuke. Here we go. Change all key spheres to purple with Poir. And then we're going to change them all to green. And then we're gonna change them all to blue. I'm so excited to do this. He is such a beast, guys. He is such a beast. Oh man, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt everybody. Look at that, we're gonna get every single orb except one. We're gonna get all of our health back, hopefully. Look at that, whoop! <laughs> I know, oh, we all got it all back. Oh my gosh. Um, maybe we'll get two super attacks. Nice. Here we go. All right guys, get ready for this. So we're gonna first get the counter. So let's see how much we get with the counter. Not a critical. Oh, 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 oh! Did you see that? 1.7 mil! Not even a counter! 3.3, I mean not even a crit, and we just got 3.3 million, not even a crit. Wow! Dude, that is some heavy, heavy damage right there. Damn, dude, he is not messing around. Oh man, I really hope I can make it. <laughs> Let me see. All right, let's get a boost. Don't let me down, LR Vegito. <laughs> Don't die. And then we got Hanky Trunks wrapping it up at the end. <laughs> Hanky Trunks, don't let us die. You know, I might have to probably, I'm probably gonna have to nuke it here if I get the opportunity. Because the last thing I want to do is, is die. And it looks like I'm probably gonna die. I hope I don't die though. <laughs> don't die! Don't die! Oh, you suck, Trunks! Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna do a continue. Really sucks to use a Dragonstone, guys. Um, but the new test is already going, so that was really painful for me because I'm really low on Dragonstones right now. So the video deserves a thumb up, if anything, for that. <laughs> Just to complete the nuke test. The things we do. <laughs> oh man, and I'm scared because I wanted to get two counters uh, with Vegito, but I'm afraid that he's gonna super attack me and kill me. So <laughs> we're gonna have to do it this way. All right, so let's go right here. All right, go down the line. I'm really anxious to see what this does. All right. All right, do your thing, bro. Do your thing. No matter what we do, we're gonna miss a few. That's okay. All right, now we're gonna get a Goku in there. And wrap this up. All right, Vegeta. Let's see if you can take him out in one hit. Damn! 1.6 million against Tech, and it wasn't even a crit. Absolutely insane. He is a monster. And for those of you who've never done this event before, this is where it gets tough if you don't have a good team. As you can see, he has a whole lot of health. <laughs> And he's definitely gonna kill me right now. <laughs> like, we're dead. There's no way we're gonna survive. We got 90,000 health. Come on, do your, do your best, LR Vegito. <laughs> It'd be nice if we can get to the end and get one more uh, Vegeta in here, but I don't think it's gonna happen. However, I will cross my fingers and hope that it does. Nope, we're dead. We're definitely not gonna continue here though, we're out. Okay, so we're gonna hit no. All right, so as you guys can see, we didn't get any crits that time, but his attack power is just out of this world. Between the counters that he can do, like, it's just absolutely insane. And now you guys are gonna see him in all of his glory. The nuke test was fun, but I'm sure you guys wanna see how he does by himself on a team where he can actually really shine. So let's just um, switch this up really quick. We're going to unselect Goku, and then reselect. 
There we go. And then we're just gonna change our items really quick. Oh, or not. <laughs> I hit the wrong button. That's okay, we'll be fine. I hope. <laughs> All right, let's see. Go this way this time. Do you guys ever do that and just get so frustrated? You just hit, like you just want to get into the game so fast and you just completely mess up and you forget to change your items or you forget to change, like, I'll be doing like the world tournament to get the, to get the Zenny. And then I'll go back into the game to do what I was doing before I switched. And I'm just so, I'm so frustrated. I'm just trying to get, get the game to load that I don't even look. And then all of a sudden, I'm trying to clear an event like this with my world tournament team. And then it's just like, stamina out the window at that point. <laughs> Here we go. This is what I like to see. Nice. This is nice. Good, only taking 88 damage. Come on, Goku, take him out. So guys, I actually have one dupe in my Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Damn, that was a lot of damage. Three more to go, we can rainbow him and do a showcase. Nice! Get Vegeta right in the front. Get a super attack off with him, good. And then we'll save those four greens for Goku. What a difference, huh? You go from having 90,000 health to over 300,000. <laughs> Just from changing your lead, man. Wow, he, he totally did not let us do a counter attack. That's not cool. Look at that, 978,000 uh, on a crit without the nuke. Oh, did you guys see how the screen just turned red? That's how you know a counter from him is gonna be critical. Every time you see that flash of red, you know that your Vegeta's about to do a counter critical attack. Now we're getting all kinds of crits now. Figures, we didn't get them when we wanted them during the nuke test, but that's okay. All right. Let's switch these up. You know what, I'm just gonna use a poir. There we go. Now we're gonna do some damage. All right, we need four, that's good. So which super attack do you guys like better from LR Vegito Blue? I think this one's cool, but I kinda like the other one better. And do you ever notice this right here? It kinda looks like Krillin, right? Doesn't that look like Krillin? <laughs> I think it's cool that the other Vegito Blue has the same super attack when he's in his base form. Alright Goku, do some damage bro. Nice. Looks like we're gonna make it to the end, we didn't need any Sensu Beans. Oh, here we go. Alright Vegeta, do some counters for me. Vegeta will probably take him out all by himself right now. And if for those of you who are trying to get your Mass Saiyan medals, my Vegeta tanks that event pretty much by himself as well. That's not a critical. The screen didn't turn red. But he's gonna do his attack, and then hopefully the next one will be a crit so we can see the damage. 646. See, even against even against tech, obviously his his type advantage would be against Fizz. Even against tech, he's able to do some devastating damage. All right, we're gonna have to uh, <laughs> hopefully cross our fingers here. Let's see, I'm gonna turn some blues, some greens, there we go. And we're gonna shoot off a super, an ultimate super attack with our Vegito Blue now. Here we go. 
And then we got our boy Vegeta coming out in the next round. The first time I did this event, I was using my uh, my Super AGL team, and I like it was it was it was. I mean, I beat it. It was definitely a grind. It was, I should have been paying more close attention that it was Tech Vegito's event before I went after it with my Super AGL team. Nice. Look at that. He's taking barely any damage. There he is. There he is. We're gonna put him right in front. All right, all those orbs are for him. These are for you. And we should be able to kill him right now. If those three attacks aren't super attacks, it's the first one's a super. Well, let's see how much damage he takes. Only 80,000, not too bad. And now we're gonna see two counters after this. So you're gonna see a lot of damage about to be dealt. So 300,000 there. Blocks for 85, which is great. That's not a crit, let's hope the next one is. Again, blocking for 89. Yes, critical! 453,000 damage, guys. And like I said, he crits a lot. You've already seen him do crits multiple times. And then it looks like we have Gogeta's gonna finish off the event. So as you guys can see, STR Vegeta, Upper of Emotions, he does some devastating damage. You know, on a, on a complete super strength team, he is just one of the best units to have. I mean, what he's there for support, he's there to attack. I mean, he's just there to clean up is basically what it is. And now, as promised, guys, we're gonna go to Hidden Potential, and I will show you what I did. There he is. So as you guys can see, I maxed out his crit at 20. Uh, his his uh, ability to perform multiple attacks is at 6, and then obviously his super attack is maxed out at 15. Um, and then I usually go back and forth depending on how I'm playing. Um, with him, I kind of rely on him to take some more health because he's going to take a beating. So that's why I did the, the recovery boost at 15. Um, but usually when I do my hidden potential for characters, I'll either do a uh, full recovery boost or I'll take one of those which is um, down here, this one right here, and I'll actually put that into um, type defensive boost. But for the most part, this is how I do my hidden potential. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. You got to see Vegeta at his finest tearing it up. And if you enjoyed the video, please show some love and smash that like and subscribe button. And as always, more good stuff coming soon. See you guys.